Well, oil giant China National Offshore Oil Cooperation has commenced work on a vast regional oil pipeline over in Uganda. This marks another example of cooperation under the Belt and Road Initiative. The oil pipeline is set to boost the development of Uganda's economy, creating tens of thousands of local jobs in the process. Our Sun Yotian has more. Sinuk plans to exploit the huge crude oil reserves under Lake Albert on the border between Uganda and the Democratic Republic of Congo. Industry experts say that exploration project is an ideal example of the growing cooperation between China and African countries. Spread over 1,500 square kilometers, the oil field has potential deposits of at least 6 billion barrels of oil. It was discovered in 2006 by Uganda. Sinuk, which joined the project in 2011, currently has a 28 percent stake in the oil field. The construction process and operation of the oil field will create more than 20,000 jobs in Uganda. It will also improve local employment and boost the training of local talent in the oil exploration sector. The first phase of the project includes two central processing factories and 35 well factories and is expected to become operational in 2025. The project also entails building a 1,400-kilometer oil pipeline facilitating future oil exports. Once the oil field is operational, it will provide new development opportunities for Uganda, which relies heavily on agriculture and cattle raising. The country will also become a key oil producer in East Africa. China National Offshore Oil Corporation is one of the biggest Chinese investors in Uganda. It focuses on localizing its talent group, having developed 150 local contractors and trained more than 3,000 technical staff. The company has conducted energy cooperation with 40-plus countries across six continents. Sun Yao Tian, CGTN.